Welcome, I'm Daily Fix, and we are playing Space Engineers. I'm actually very excited because I've been working really hard, and I actually did a few configurations on um, on, on our ship. Uh, well, not that you can actually see. What I uh, mainly did is uh, <laughs> on the hotbar, I, uh, I changed the thing, and that has been... Let's go first person for a second. Has been amazing. As you can see that on 6, I have a drill, and if I press... Uh, the right mouse button, um, it actually uses the drill. I, I don't know if it used it without it. I actually want to test that before I'm speaking out of my, my ass again. Yeah, as you can see here, the uh, I'm pressing the left and right mouse button at the moment and nothing has happened. So by just going toggling blocks, putting that in there, it will have it so you can actually right and left mouse button your way through your uh, rocks. And that's been great. Also, I'm noticing there is uh, something over there. Let, let's go to that unknown signal for a second. Um, because why not? Why, why not? Uh, let's see. Ooh, might it, maybe it will explode. Not sure. Um, oh god, here we go. Okay, press K now. New specialized item. Oh, that scared me so much because it was getting red. Oh, boy. So, yeah, that's cool. I, I really, really like that. So, I've been purchasing the... Um, that's the wrong button. Uh, I've been purchasing the, um, the, net, the all of the DLCs. And it brought me a, a lot of, um, of cool features like ladders. And we got an armory over here. The kitchen... Uh, uh, Planters apparently, which is cool. We got the industrial cockpit. Um, I don't know what else is new, that, but there's a bunch. There truly is a a bunch. We got sound blocks. Don't know if this it, it was a thing. Corner LCD top. Corner lights I've been using. Uh, cover cover walls. Oh, that is nice. I like that. Um, are there things like plants? Is, is there a plant thing? I'd say it would be around here somewhere. A toilet, lockers, console block. A console table for decoration, interior projecting ships and stations in custom scales, as well as displaying... Oh, that's nice. A planter for decorating items. Seriously? What the hell is that? Let's see. Um, where's my base? Um... First base, there you go. Oh, it looks nice. Really looks nice. Um, cool. Man, I like that. Not like that. Oh, that is sweet. I like it. Um, is there a way for us to get in, like, say, like, like regular plants? That would be fantastic. So, I've been working. Let's cut to the chase. I've been working here for um, for our garage. However, uh, seeing the space like this is um, it's not doing it for me. Can you imagine that? It's uh, it's not doing it. Also, uh, where is my music? That's way better. <laughs> Yeah, sure. Why? Why not do the uh, the sound? Uh, I think I had that uh, on on mute because I was watching um, either Genesis stream or Wenek, one of my Discord members. Uh, so what I'm thinking about using in this space for is I want to get some refineries in here, uh, but also we need a way into this basement, and I'd say that's that's quite nice to do that this time. Uh, we also need to look into a thing called a welder. I've been asked to make a welder. I've also been asked to... Um, I don't have steel plates, that's unfortunate. Uh, I've also been asked to uh, start doing stuff with hydrogen, which is actually a very nice idea and I really like it. So, yeah, we, we've got a lot of plans, but first things first. We want to make sure that there is a room going downwards. And... In all honesty, I'm thinking, you know, this is here, but it is, it's not where I want it to be. 
and we want to change that and I'm thinking this is an ideal way of going to a bottom location perhaps with uh, say stairs we could do a ladder but I rather go with a ladder to the uh, to the roof and have a, a, a little construction on there hiding this thing so let's, uh, let's get the ladder let's take a look on how that is uh, actually going let's flip you oh yeah oh we can do that maybe this door eventually is going to be removed and this is going to be the entrance so it's going to be quite nice if, if we have a ladder in here then that would be quite nice at least i, I do hope so that's not how you do this but what is up and what is down so i, I would like to have it over here and I'll, I'll remove the um, the other blocks at a later later moment. Mm, okay, so I'll have to do that right away. So let us not do that right now. Let's get rid of these. Man, I, I really seriously love the idea that I have so many new options. I'm, I'm so hyped by this. So I would like to move these. And most likely get rid of this one and place it down uh, maybe somewhere else. Also, um, I want to get more refineries. Now, there is an amazing feature, uh, which is the planner. And the planner has been so, so great. Because you can just queue things up and deposit stuff in, in your cargo facilities uh, over here. So, what I do is I queued up a few more of these refineries that we're going to be dragging down here um, for now we're going to get rid of this oh that might have been we need to get rid of the ice i'm not sure if we are oh, we're going to be having a lot of ice here right yeah I, the figures so inventory. inventory full and then i go over here and i middle mouse button no control middle mouse button cannot withdraw oh we alt middle mouse button that is so convenient that is insanely convenient. That has been the best feature like ever. Saves me a lot of things. Once I actually get the get a hang of this, then it would actually be even better. So also means that we get to get rid of you. Uh, we're still full on inventory, uh, which is fine. I, I promise I won't die. And if I do, you will never hear the end of it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, because that would be horrible. So we can just go over here. And let's remove these. There is something lying over there. Apparently my inventory is full again. Now why would I want to... I keep doing the same thing. Why would I want to remove this portion? Well, because of this uh, this pipe here. And it, it's, been, it's been harming my brain a lot. And I know, I know, like that is absolutely possible. What a dumb remark. How could you say that? Uh, we want to get a a good block. A light armor block. Heavy armor, interior walls. Have these changed now due to the light? We can actually use the planner. And you can see that we are uh, currently still trying to do a refinery in here. So I've been trying. I've been practicing a bit. Um, quite worried actually the sound might be a bit too high. Um... Let's put you down to about negative 40, which which is, should be fine. So let us take a block. And we need some steel plates. So let's put everything in there. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Go away. You as well. Why can I not put you in there? Because we are full. We are currently full. Ooh, that is not good. And we still have to bring everything in here. So maybe what we could do is... Can we can we actually get to these conveyors and do anything with them? No, we cannot. So it has to be a cargo container. There's no other option. Are there other options? I, I know for a fact there are people actually watching that have been playing for a, for a long ass time. And those people I'm trying to uh, get a hold on so that is fine for this floor let's get into four let's put that over here that is the wrong button that's not how you do it we need way more iron and we're going to be looking into the stairs 
We'll bring uh, about 80. That's fine. I kind of feel that this is where we want to have it going in. So let's get our... Where are you? Stairs. Stairs. Here we go. And we'll put those on five. So how many blocks does it need? By the looks of it, it needs two blocks. And that's great. Let's go. Um, if we go in here. And I don't want to go next to the wall. So maybe... Well, if I get it away from the wall too much, it's probably going to be looking so funny. I cannot use this block over here because the window is actually on it. So maybe we'll have to do it from here. Maybe the one block that I just placed is just going to be horribly in the way. And you can see I still have a lot of work to do. So that also means that block is going to be in the way. Okay, let's get our drill. Let's jump on here. Come on. That's how we want to do it. And I'm afraid that we might... Oh, there is... Look at that. That could be definitely a little corner. There you go. Is there a way for us to get rid of this portion? Uh, probably not without removing this. There you go. That looks a lot better. So, let's bring you back in here. And this conveyor block can still remain over here. We're probably going to be placing down a cargo container. So, let's go by 5 and press that. We need interior plates. Okay, cool. We only have a few, which is so far so good. Um... I kind of want to get rid of this small container eventually and just post everything right here in the large container. So if we go to large, base, large container, so base. If we go to base, there we go, base, small, base, base, large. And we can just post everything right in there. Because we don't want everything in here. What I can use these small containers for in the future is um, probably... Let's do this differently. Um, large cargo. There you go. That, this, this probably is going to be a lot easier. There you go. Way, way easier. So um, I, I want to use these small containers to prepare builds. I've already been preparing, as you can see most likely over here. I've been trying to prepare ourselves into two refineries, but all of the plates are now in there, which is uh, definitely a shame. Let us get into our personal inventory and get some interior plates with us. So we want to make this a as smooth as operation as possible. And I can't believe that I'm actually trying to do a video here on, on building a a way down. <laughs> Can you imagine? Get some construction components. I didn't know we needed them. Uh, that's a bit on the low side. Do we have more construction? There we go. That's a bunch. It's more than enough, most likely. So let's get the staircase done. Um, oh, there is a bit of a problem. So I kind of think that we might want to get rid of you. Because I don't want to go too close to the outer wall, even though it is... Wait, can we can we do this one without making this look extremely weird? It probably is going to look extremely weird. So, I guess we'll just have to do with the fact that this is going to be... It's just one block. How bad can it be, right? So, let's get you, you, so otherwise we can't build anything. And get you in there. So, that is going... To... Oh, that's not where I want to put you. Go away. So, you, over here. And this way we can actually continue on the build. And hopefully I won't die. Let's get a, another staircase out of this. Um, let's flip you over. Meaning you are in the way as well. Get rid of you. And weld you together as well as you. So, it's going to be a little bit of a staircase down. St downstairs, yeah, a staircase downstairs. <laughs> Who would have imagined a staircase going downstairs? It bothers me. 
it bothers me. This bothers me quite a bit. I don't like it. Um, I think we do need to get rid of you. And you... Because I want to go right next to the wall. Man, this, and, and I've what I've been thinking about is um, getting the base like like done further into the ground and more to the side, so we can have uh, windows popping out at some places, and we'll have a uh, another entrance around probably uh, this height because it is as low as the base is currently. This will make driving in towards the oxygen or to the hydrogen lake, the ice lake, a lot easier. And we have room to build, uh, continue our build, and, and we'll have this massive, massive building without every, every, without anyone knowing. That's the word I was looking for. So let us get rid of you again. You and you. We do need to get you. Well, actually, yeah, we do. Otherwise, this is going to be absolutely awkward, having to walk inside of the wall, and this will change. I'll think of I'll think of something, but I I will get it done. I promise you. Oh, can't move. Let's go down. I was actually worried that I was pressing the wrong wrong uh, key over there. So you're going to be there, and we're going we're going to be continuing alongside this pathway. So you. Hmm, we could start digging out in there. What? We also could do, and I think that might be the best course of action, is try to flip. So we'll have blocks over here, and you're going to be out. So you. And we could do these with... Um, let's see, with, where are you? What's the name? It's below here somewhere. Like railings? I've seen it somewhere, I just I can't remember where. Uh, armory, heavy armory, blocks. Um, like walkways, pathways. Um, here you are, catwalks. That might be the easiest solution. And then use the staircase instead of the blocks. Uh, but we'll have to use blocks in order to actually get this this working so if we flip you into that direction we can go down by two more and this wall will probably have to be filled up completely in order not to make it look like it is just the weirdest thing ever constructed meaning you have to be filled but we're almost there so let's go into this position and we could go over here though like this. So let's get our blocks in there. And let's get a clear hand. So and this would be our way down. And there you go. We might change this uh, this pillar. And we're going we were going to change it anyways due to the um, due to the ladder to the roof. And we can actually use these uh, where are you again? Uh, catwalk, catwalk, catwalk. Steel walkers. I think these might be the ones that I want. Let's see if we you can flip you. Oh, that's the wrong way. Can we get like a single rail? Is there a way? A railing. What would be a what would be a nice railing? Is it a covered wall? It's not that. Oh, there's two different staircases. That is interesting. Hmm. I need to think of a way how to do that. I'm not quite sure yet. I'm looking there at the uh, the right side over here because it shows you uh, the other options for blocks. And I'm just trying to see if there is a real way. Well, if you know how to make this a lot safer, especially for me, and I now will promise you I will get myself killed if there is nothing holding me back, but I do want to make it look 
um, a bit pretty. So yeah, I got, I got a lot of things to do. So with this done, um, I still have, I'll, I'll make this a bit longer in an episode, who cares, right? So I would like to go into my, let, let's drop everything in there for now. And how did I do that again? If I go to G and get refinery, build planner, let's get rid of you. I think we can get into here and go withdraw for, from build planner and cannot withdraw these because they're not in that small and I'm completely full. That might be the... Oh no! Whoa! Damn that! Oh, I was so happy. I need to get my medical bay up and running really smooth. Do you see what happened there? I'm going to get myself killed. And that's not a lie. I still like this. I like how this goes. So I want to get refineries up and running. Most likely around here somewhere. So let's get our refineries. Not in our building plan, but actually on, on like seven. So how large are these contraptions again? If, um, if we build them around here, like two of them. I don't want to have them completely run against the wall, but they could be... Mm, they could be side to side, right? Because I don't think there is any port available on the side of them. Unfortunately, I, I have to go in my third person and... See, there's all the blocks. There's a side entrance. And you, so... Hmm, it means that the connections, or actually the, I could place it down like this, of course. We can connect them from the roof. How about I leave a space in between? No, like this. So I want to have, eventually I want to have three. And I would like to have one over here. So we'll flip the staircase just a tiny bit more. And we're going to have three refineries. Like this. And how we are connecting them up. I, I, I will have to see. Uh, but I'm thinking there is a room. Yeah, there is a refinery over there, that part. And there's one in the bottom. Well, the one in the bottom we're most likely not going to be using, but we can connect them up um, right on top of here. And the connection to the, um, the modules will be placed on the back. So three of them, that will definitely help us in the future. And luckily we still have this... Um, uh, how is this thing called again? Um... A conveyor junction so it can be looked up over here and there so let's get a few conveyor junctions out so conveyor do we have other conveyors now is that something or is that mod mod related well, it could be it's most likely mod related so let's get six let's put you in there but we need interior plates of course we do what else a Yurik conveyor, so that won't work. And I need to get my medical room set up around here. Let's do that right now before I will kill myself. And that is definitely not something that is highly upon my list of things to do. Uh, we don't need you at the moment, so let's get this. Why do I always press the wrong damn button? Yeah, around there. So we need interior plates. Let's get some interior plates from over here. Like 17 should be enough for now. Maybe more in the corner over there. Yeah, let's do it right here. So we'll have to make the entirety of that. Let us start construction on the refineries. So we can actually use the components from the other refinery. And we'll keep a, uh, a row here in the back. So for access. 
So let's get started on our very first, uh, actually our second refinery. It's going to be a huge upgrade. We're going to be, uh, we're going to need a lot of power. And I've been thinking about reactors and getting reactors in there would definitely be interesting for me. Now there is a way with the um, pressing mouse button will withdraw components. So it is now withdrawing the components for those refineries, which is absolutely brilliant. I really love the planner. I really do. Now all we need is an easier way for me to access those. So getting a um, getting a medical, and then not a medical, getting a small uh, small cargo container would be actually ideal. Ah, every time, I don't like that. Uh, here we go, and we're getting there. We are getting there. It's just a bunch of components. Uh, luckily for us, we have enough hydrogen in our hydrogen bottles, and uh, definitely we can withdraw all of the um, all of the items. I was actually going to say something else, but I'm way too excited again. I need to dial down a bit. Uh, apparently that didn't end the way I hoped. It's a bit of a bummer. Anyways, what I do for you is I'm going to be constructing those refineries and we're going to be adding speed modules and um, we are going to be adding proficiency modules. And I have an idea for the assemblers as well. As you can see there is uh, two on each side and there's one over here. So if I manage a an easy way of placing these down, we can have a lot of speed modules on our assemblers, making this all a bit better. Also, I've been told that I need way more batteries and you're right, my batteries are running very, very low. It's going to be a thing that we'll have to deal with. Therefore, I wanna go into hydrogen and with that comes uh, reactors. No, actually not, not reactors, but we need to find that nuclear power is uranium. Actually, do we have hydrogen engines? Hydrogen engine, we can actually do that. Get a lot of ice and have our base run on hydrogen engine. Oh yeah, I, I have a lot of ideas, guys. Bear with me because we need, we're not there yet. I can't go to space with a half-baked base. I would like to go to space, seeing all of those stars up close. Having combat because I've heard that there are hostile, hostile aliens in space. I can't wait. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. I, uh, I, I honestly hope you've enjoyed. And I'll, uh, I'll see you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.